All right, so we're going to go ahead and finish up the coding for this and, and show you how it looks in the web page. So uh, we just put our block quote, uh, you put, you know, three sentences at least kind of in your block quote there. I think that's what it requires in the uh, written instructions on this. And what we want to do now is we're going to do an unordered list, which is basically a bullet point list. And so we start our tag there. We tab in. We start our tag. Uh, UL which is unordered list okay and then we're going to put uh, LI which is a list item um, and uh, different types of accounting can be forensic okay and then we're gonna close that one so each one you gotta close okay and then we got Mental and then the next is going to be so we're putting each uh, put at least three on here uh, for yours okay and then we're gonna have tax so that'll be the next here and we've got to make sure to close each one of those so each of those are closed and then we're going to go ahead and close our unordered list uh, tag and then we're going to close our block quote tag and then we're going to close the last div tag that we opened up okay so we closed a bunch okay now uh, here at the very bottom we're gonna we're gonna do another picture and then we're gonna include a a link to a website that's what we're gonna do so we're gonna go ahead and start out with another div we're gonna give this one style so we're gonna say uh, the style on this one is going to be Text align center okay so that's going to be the style on this this one and then we're going to say this is going to be our link and so we're going to give it an h href so we're going to reference so we're going to reference something which is in the computer talk is basically we're going to point it in a direction so we're going to say the direction we're going to give it is going to be to uh, this website so you got to give it the entire website starting with uh, your http uh, colon back forward slash forward slash www dot and you can get this uh, from the top of your web browser if you if you want to know exactly what the link is that you're going to go to mine is going to be to the American Institute of uh, Certified Public Accountants okay uh, and then oops Okay, so that's going to be it. We're going to close that. And then we're going to actually say what this link is to. So this is going to be the, the linked text, which is American Institute of CPAs. Okay. We're going to close our a tag. So the beginning of our a tag was here above the the h or before the h ref. So we're going to going to go ahead and close that, and then we are going to close our div tag. Okay. So that's where we're at, and we're going to go ahead and open up another div. 
We're going to give it some style. And this one is going to be the same here. So we're going to go text line center and then we're going to insert our second uh, picture which this one is image source equals uh, let's see this this one this time is going to be um, picked to I think is how what I named it if you need to check make sure to check you want to make sure you have the exact same name and extension and then our alternative text just like we had before is going to be something along the lines of accounting picked picture okay and then we're going to give it a border just like we gave the other one a border different width this time And then we're going to close our div tag. Okay. Then we're going to go ahead and do one more tag here. Do another div. Uh, and then we're going to give it, a, uh, do some text. We're going to do it a different size and we're going to go ahead and do a different style. So the style on this one is going to, we're going to include, uh, just like we did before, we're going to align it, okay, to the center. Uh, but this time, instead of just closing out right there, we're going to actually make it bold, okay and strong. So depending on the web browser you're using, bold and strong actually mean the same thing, but just depends on which web browser you're using, you've got to use both. So just to make sure it renders correctly, then we're going to close that one out, and we're going to put uh, accounting. So under this, this is going to be a title for this picture, accounting at work. Close the H3 tag. And then we're going to close our div tag. And then we got to close our body tag since we opened it up at the beginning. Okay. And then we got to close. The, at very last, we are closing our HTML tag. HTML. Okay. And so that's that. Make sure to save this in your text file. So save the text file. And then you can save as. Again, you can do your HTM. Save. It's going to say it's already there, but go ahead and save over it, especially if you've done it before. And then what we should be able to do is open up our folder and then see our web page. There we go. There's our web page. Beautiful. There's our link. We'll see if it works. Click on our link, and there's our link. Our link works. Our, we our web page looks beautiful, and we're good to go. So when you submit this, you want to submit your HTM and your two JPEGs, or your two picture files. That could be not necessarily JPEGs. It could be something else, but go ahead and do not, you don't have to submit your text file. So just your HTM, .htm, and then your two picture files, or if you have more, you can submit them all on that link, on the, the same way you submit the other picture or the other assignments. And then I'll pull them off, put them in a folder, and then open your web page to make sure it works. And hopefully yours will work like this, centered up with the bullet points, and um, you might want to check your spelling too there. 
uh, before you submit it. So I, I look, check, look this up and I kind of looked at it and I can go back 